In this video, I'm going to share to all of you on how you can easily bypass the iCloud activation screen on your iOS device. So the first step that you need to do is go to this site which is sponsored by Wutaki iSalvor. Just proceed to this download page and you can use in either Mac or Windows. So it depends on your what OS you're using. So for me I'm going to use Windows version since I'm using Windows. Once you downloaded the setup file, proceed to app installation. Once finished, open the app hit yes and the app should now load here now plug in your iPhone using your lightning connector to your PC or your desktop computer as you can see my iPhone is iCloud locked and once connected just close all of these programs that also detects iPhone now press start now it requires your iPhone to be jailbroken you can you can follow their jailbroken tutorial in their website by pressing that green bar on the left side or you can either follow my step which is I'm going to do right now. So in this step, just download this app or program which is called Trio Tools. Once finished, connect your iDevice and proceed to this section which is called Flash and Jailbreak section. Now go to this jailbreak into the left side. Now plug in your USB flash drive with at least 2 gigabytes of storage now just close this and now press make check range shell break USB flash drive now the flash drive will be automatically detected and just hit start making and proceed to yes once finished you're, you are required to go to boot or bias menu of your PC if you don't know what keys are on your selected brands I'll also leave a link in the description below or you can also watch my previous video which is also about jailbreaking your iDevice by checking the cards above of your screen once finished restart your PC if you're using Dell press F12 to enter into boot menu I'm just pressing F12 right now and you should now proceed to the boot menu now I'm going to select the flash drive that which we inputted the iOS image file just hit enter okay wait until it's finished now it says that my iPhone SE is not supported but all of the A9 devices such as iPhone 6S and 6, 6S Plus are supported to be jailbroken on iOS 14. So in order to fix that, just go to options and hit allow untested iOS version. Now, <coughs> replug in your iPhone to your PC just to make sure. Now, hit start by pressing enter and hitting enter again by, pro by pressing OK. Now, the device needs to be put in DFU mode just hit enter once the device is in recovery mode there is also another step that you need to do now just follow the instructions on the screen now press start but for the iPhone SE I need to press the top and home button for at least 4 seconds and release the top the power button and hold the home button for at least 10 seconds and as you can see I'm doing it right now okay let's wait until the jailbreak is finished the jailbreak is successful if you if it shows in your boot screen like this okay it looks like the jailbreak is successful now restart your PC and once you restart your PC open the 
program again and you can now proceed to the next step which is the bypassing of the activation lock now plug in your iPhone again now then hit start then select start bypass and wait until the bypass of activation screen is finished now it's finished press back on the lower in the upper left of your screen and just wait for a few more seconds okay press the left and, and as you can see the bypass is successful thank you iSalver for sponsoring this video for more information about the software and the bypass check the description box below and see you in my next video bye